Hey everyone, Miss Kabumba here. Shout out to the, all the Soul Leader fans who decided to click my video. I'm gonna show you how I recreated Liz's look. So I made the hat myself and I'm gonna show you how we did this and we transformed it into this. All right, so other than thrifting a hat, you're gonna need some fabric. So I got this fabric from Dollar Store white of course and you're gonna need some blue it's very affordable and you're gonna need a hot glue gun this is gonna be your lifesaver some scissors i know you can find in your house and a little hand sewing kit i know i said this is a no sew sewing video but you're gonna need this if you want to perfect everything okay so this is all of the white fabric i got this is how it looks fold fold it open that's a lot um i'm just gonna cut two parts in a circle so it looks a little weird right now but this is basically gonna go on the top of the hat and the bottom of the hats and that space i'm gonna show you how it works right so that space is gonna fit into here it may not look like it's the exact proportions but it's a stretchy hat this is what i mean so i just placed it on the top to show y'all and I'm gonna place it at the bottom. And I'm using hot glue to stick everything, but right now it's not glued. I just want to show you guys how it looks. The 360, see what I mean? It may be a little bigger, but it's gonna be fine. Once I glue everything together. Yeah, I just want to cover the whole hat. So this is gonna be for the inside of the hat. And I cut a few squares. So I believe I cut two squares here right right and i'm gonna cut those in half so it's gonna be triangle right there so the first square that was cut into a triangle we're gonna use that and hot glue it around the top of the hats so this was after i already glued things on the top of the hat this is the inside and the inside is going to be all glued with white fabric as well because i want the whole hat to be white i don't want people to see the black part of the hat i want it to look like it was store-bought you know or a custom costume custom costume it is a custom costume it's a cosplay anyways this is how it looks like after i hot glued um the hat and i want to show you guys how it looks like on me right it's already in a perfect shape all right so remember those two squares i cut into the triangles you're gonna hot glue them around the hats and i grabbed a bunch of F extra fabric from the second square cut them and i'm gonna use them inside of the hats like that i'm gonna scrunch it up use it inside of the hats so the hat looks big from the top and this is how it looks like after I hot glued a bunch of things together. I'm still not done working on the folds. So I use certain portions where I just hot glued the white folds, like folding it so it's in a perfect list shape because her hat is really crinkly. This is how it looks like on my head with just hot gluing everything. I definitely have to work on the blue parts and i want to hand sew the edges this is how what i'm showing how i i use that the measuring tape to add the blue fabric in because you're going to need that to know the perfect sizing here's the blue dang my camera's got good quality and these blue little circles you're going to need at the sides of the hat like right there right where i'm holding it at my thumb it's already looking good but you see the edges why i want to hand sew it you don't have to you do not have to hand sew it but it's just for perfectionism reasons like you can still see the edges popping out but a good thing is that liz's hat is super crafty so you're not gonna have to hand sew the edges if you don't want to but then i cut some little squares and you're going to see me hot glue it around. And there we have it. It didn't take too long. This is a project you can finish in a day. 
And here is me and my friends at Anime North Halloween. And a few edits that I did. So my friend Tareen dressed up as Def the Kid. We met up with other Soul Eater cosplayers. There's Maka. There's Frankenstein. There's an edit of my friend Tareen. So thank you so much for watching and staying tuned for yet another cosplay tutorial. My videos come out on Tuesdays, Thursdays, or Sundays. So I like to upload once or twice a week. Bye. I love you so much.